Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Hey, so this is kind of an exciting video for me. Yeah. Today I'm going to be reviewing the Bleak Boy Repellent Glitter Palette number one. I'm so excited, like I've been waiting and waiting and every time I go to the, to the website to purchase it, it's always sold out. So I finally got my hands on it. Let me tell you the backstory. So this was, when did I order this? I ordered this palette I believe it was on Thanksgiving Day I do I was I kept kind of going back on the website every couple of maybe weeks or so and you know it was always sold out and I was just like huh. so on Thanksgiving Day I was like you know what I saw I saw like I think a post on Instagram and I went on and it was in stock and it's $25 so I went and I purchased it great why the next day? I think it was the next day. If not, it was like the 27th or something. But I think it was the next day after Thanksgiving. So Black Friday. Why did I see that the palette was on sale for $20? Wait, the day before it was $25. That I, the day before when I ordered it, it was $25. And the day after, it went on sale for $20. I was like, okay. So not only was the palette on sale actually i actually see that the um i believe her name is brie i think it's her company brie let's call her brie um she actually is coming out with a glitter palette too which at this point in time is already out and for sale so and i'm so tight because i want that palette as well but now i gotta like budget myself you know so I'm going to tell you a little bit about what I know thus far. Um, if you have seen my previous video, I have done a review on the um, highlighter sprays, the Bleep Boy Repellent Spray, as well as the highlighter. I've done reviews on both of those, so I'll probably put the link in the description box so you guys can see. So I've done those absolutely, absolutely, I absolutely love those products. I use that every now and again. I'm actually going to be using it today as my highlighter, so... Okay, so I'm I'm excited now that she's branching out into pressed glitters or eyeshadows. Because it's really cool. I'm waiting for her to come out with lipsticks. You know, I'm waiting for her to fuck around and come out with um, eyeliners, everything. Like, I'm super duper excited. When you have a company this, I don't want to say small, but this intimate, I should say. They really care about what how they package things. They care about what consumers say because that can affect you in the long run, of course. Um, this is a black owned business by a college student. So yay. I actually found out about her from Naturally Sunny. She's another YouTuber and she actually did a giveaway, I believe, with, I think she did a giveaway. And that's kind of when I learned about the um, company itself. So I followed on Instagram. I think I followed her when she had like 10k or something and now she has almost 35,000 so girl <laughs> I'm here for it one thing I love also she actually replies to your dms you know I have dm'd her she I have probably I have tagged her in a few of my posts and she has actually dm'd me back which is great like you know like that's personal that's that's marketing that's someone who actually cares about what they're doing enough to actually figure out if I have any concerns or not. So she's great at replying for, to DMs. If you have any questions, feel free to slide into the DMs. She will repost you. I know I have a couple of, I have posted about the company a couple of times on my Instagram and I have been reposted by her. So it, it's, it's great. Like it's bringing awareness and also, you know, you're supporting me. Like I support you, you support me. See how that works? Yeah. yeah. So this product came in shrink wrap, which I love as well i'm gonna love a lot of things you're gonna hear me saying the word love a lot but it came in shrink wrap it's a very professional it's very it, it's very sanitary as well the fact that it does come in shrink wrap so we're gonna do a whole unboxing slash first impressions so this is the palette Ooh. oh my gosh okay so it comes with this little film on top look at that i'm shook like i'm shook so there are 15 shades they don't have any names to them which is fine but 15 shades i'm so excited to swatch this i don't think you guys understand i'm not gonna swatch all of them i'm not i'm gonna swatch i'm gonna swatch that deep blue i'm gonna swatch that yellow and i'm gonna swatch that this middle shade right here 
this white glitter and I want to see like how exactly this works like do I need glitter glue do I not I know I was kind of reading up on um, the website and she said that you technically don't need any glitter glue because there's adhesive mixed into the formula so you don't need it but either or I may try so this is the yellow oh you have to like pick up okay I was like swatching it as if like I was swatch eyeshadow you need to actually like put your finger in there and take up the product so this is how much comes out so this is the yellow color this is the dark blue shade this here is the iridescent white shade right here it's picking up as if there is adhesive in it so it makes me feel like better it does have adhesive the way the formula is looking so let's see if it's actually going to stick to my eyeball here's all nice and zoomed in and up close and personal so let me use this orange oh okay okay so the shadow is applying nicely however I find that once it's on it's on so I wouldn't recommend you drag the eyeshadow because it will pick up everything so I would say to pat like take a good amount take like a good amount of product and oh wait don't do that so my eyes are done the fact that this is actually sticking like you know that's the whole thing too when you get glitter even when you have glitter glue sometimes the glitter just does not stick like for the life of you it does not stick so I'm happy that this sticks um there's no major fallout with which is also something big for me I'm someone who always does their eyes before their makeup or before the rest of their face however there are people who like to do their face first and then their eyeshadow after so this is like a great way to do that without ruining your look because if you are using something that's super duper glittery and it falls down to your makeup is you trying to swipe that away is going to take forever if it even does swipe away as for the bleak boy repellent glitter palette number one i give this product an a plus i am so excited to use this it is the holiday season still well yeah it's still it's the holiday season so you will be seeing me use this product quite a bit to see me try out holiday looks named after christmas songs so this palette is going to be this palette is going to be it for creating these looks um so stay tuned for that but i'll let you guys know that of course but thank you guys so much for watching my review slash first impression slash unboxing well there was no box so is it technically an unboxing i don't know but again thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you guys next time for real you know for real for real for real